everyone, I'm Sophie, founder of Misty's Meadows and Hillingdon TV's resident animal expert. Welcome to the enrichment session with Kaz and her 17-year-old Jack Russell, Poppy. I'm joining them on their scavenger hunt. Where's your treats? Where are your treats? How Kaz has set up this activity for Poppy involves wrapping up some treats or it could be some of your dog's food allowance into little sheets of newspaper uh, you can also use other items that you find around the home empty packets of things some of your dog's toys you can literally use anything for this activity <laughs> the good thing with this kind of activity is that once you've gone through it with them a couple of times with them you can then set them with the activity and that gives you a good couple of hours of quiet time so that you can get on with work What's this? The second part of this activity that Kaz has set up for Poppy involves putting some peanut butter on a saucer or a small plate and hidden a treat inside a toilet roll tube. <gasps> well done, kind of. <laughs> Is that what you wanted? In this activity, the spreadable human food that Kaz has used is peanut butter. If you've never tried feeding your dog peanut butter before, you can rest assured that it is absolutely safe for your dog to eat. Make sure that you buy the full fat, full sugar or natural peanut butter as the sugar-free varieties contain xylitol which is highly toxic for dogs if for whatever reason you don't want to use peanut butter that's absolutely fine as well you can instead use cream cheese or squeezy cheese such as dairy or primula you could also mash up a banana or you could use full fat natural yogurt would you like this to finish on, madam? It's your reward. Finally, Kaz has also stuffed a Kong toy for Poppy to get on with and stuffed it with more peanut butter, so that will certainly keep Poppy entertained for another little while. To demonstrate just how effective this activity is, even after we'd finished recording the activity and Poppy had found all of the treats and the peanut butter, she continued to snuffle around in the bits of newspaper for a good hour or so afterwards, just to make sure that she had found absolutely everything. Thanks so much for tuning in today. I hope you and your pooches enjoy these activities as much as Kaz and Poppy did. They had a lot of fun helping to make this video and have taken a lot away from their experience. Tune in next month for more great fun activities, tips and advice on pet care.